What's up my fellow tributes? I'm the Slash Movie Reviewer and I am so excited for Catching Fire. This is just sort of like my pre-party here on YouTube for Catching Fire. I just I just want to share my excitement. I, I want us to share our excitement together. Just Let's just talk about it. Let's just, just ramble on about how excited we are for this movie. Can we skip today? Really? Can we just like skip it and like get to the next day? Like... I just been sitting in classes all day and like writing five page papers and stuff like that and I'm just like no I don't want to do it anymore I don't want to do it anymore I just want it to be the next day I'm so excited guys I'm attending an IMAX double feature my madness begins at like 5:25 I'm gonna watch The Hunger Games and an IMAX and then shortly after Catching Fire. I'm a little disappointed that they're not having like an IMAX double feature like and then Catching Fire is at midnight. Honestly, I kind of hate this whole like 8 o'clock is like the new midnight. There is something about waiting till midnight and staying up that late to see a movie, something that you truly want to see that badly that you're able to stay up to the break of dawn the next morning if you have to, just so you could be the first people to see that. And I kind of hate that that's kind of been pushed back to 8 o'clock so they can get more people in the seats it feels like. But I really, really, really want to do the marathon, so it kind of sucks. While I am seeing it Thursday night, I hate that I'm seeing Catching Fire at like 8 o'clock. But hey, if they still have tickets available, I could go see the second showing at 11.30. So there's always that. So if you haven't read any of the books or anything like that, I, uh, this is the part where you leave because I'm about to spoil things. So yeah, spoiler alert. Bye. 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 My most anticipated scene is definitely the ending. Gail said, there is no District 12. Like, I was just like, what? Like, I want to see how they're going to handle the ending. I want to see how they're going to handle the ending. I have been reading reviews and reviews seem to say it's very anticlimactic, but the I don't know. We'll, we'll see. We'll see. We'll see. Want a sugar cube? Definitely my second most anticipated scene. I just... Finnick O'Dare. Like, he is my favorite, like, character in the entire, entire series. Which is just gonna break my heart when Mockingjay comes out. But, yes. He's my favorite character, so I'm excited about his entrance. Now, I'm a huge fan of that first movie. I thought it was actually one of the most faithful adaptations that I've seen. I knew there were changes, um, you know, Mag's not being in there. I'm gonna openly admit this, and I don't care. I'm probably the only person on this planet, and you'll never change me, who actually thinks the movie was better with the Mockingjay pin. I know, I know. Take that in, take it all in, take it all in. I feel like Katniss giving the Mockingjay pin to Prim, and then Prim giving it back to Katniss was so much better than having this random character, Madge, give her the pen. Like, I understand Madge's role, and that does kind of suck, but I think having this sort of sister connection with this pen is just far more emotional and driven, That I like that a lot more. Honestly, I'm a firm believer that just because it was written in the book doesn't make it perfect. As long as the spirit and the themes and the most important moments of the novel are in there, then I'm okay. And I guess maybe Madge giving Katniss the pen, this pen of rebellion, just wasn't up to the importance of my level. Maybe that's where I stand at that. So, question time. When are you going to go see Catching Fire? Are you doing some sort of giant premiere thing? Are you going to like the, the Thursday night premieres? Are you doing like a marathon at your house or at the theaters? Are, are you dressing up? Um, I'm actually, I just like, wait, where they are? I picked up two new shirts. I got my premiere shirt and then my victory shirt. So yeah, yeah, I'm super excited. What's your most anticipated scene? That is a very great question. Out of the three books of The Hunger Games, what is your favorite of the three? I've mentioned mine. Mine is the first one. So I'm going to get going and the next time you'll see me is for an actual review for Catching Fire. How exciting is that? So I'm going to go ahead and get on out of here. So until next time you guys, I'm the Slash Movie Reviewer and you guys have just been slashed.